Well, this will be exciting. A brand new Hygieneer update. Oh boy, think of all the chaos I can cause. Look, an NPC. Oh, he just grunted and slowly moved out of the way. I also found something else exciting. There's new vehicles to buy. Hello, sir. I would like to take a look at your goods. These ones, though. Ah, the Hydro Quads here. Also, this thing looks fun. A Hydro Roller. And thankfully, I have a spare $2.6 million laying around so I can buy your brand new bulldozer. Oh boy, it's mine now. Is there a place to put money in this thing? Oh, what are you doing up there? Please, please don't. Please just leave me alone. I have to try out my new toy. Hello, new toy. Okay, it's marginally fast. I wonder if I can derp out its physics. Let's try this picnic table. No, that wasn't as satisfying as I wanted it to be. But I did get the stupid truck stuck. She got a bit of the wiggle in it. The alignment is a little bit off. But I think, oh, I haven't bought this one yet. Oh, I was supposed to flatten the whole thing down. So I guess I'll just grab my money, run over here, and waste another $6,600. Boop. Nice. Now I can play with my new heavy equipment so I can build a farm, which I guess is the new thing in this world. We can make farms now. Okay, world, get flattened. You're not, oh, it's working. Oh, look at that. We're just kind of bulldozing everything. It's not how steamrollers work, but I'm not gonna judge anyone. Get a little bit of that wiggle going, though. Aww. Okay, maybe I'll just raise it up. Does that work? No, raising it up doesn't do anything either. On second thought, I don't really mind these hills at all. We're just gonna, you know, park that thing right in here. That's a good garage. I like that. I did flatten out the ground a little bit better, so I can casually take my money back over to town and hopefully not get mugged while I buy a new ATV. Yeah, let's just take this thing. And then I'll take over here. We'll throw our money on the back, jump inside. Oh yeah, I forgot to wear pants this morning. And then climb casually over the mountain. Whee! <laughs> I kind of like this new vehicle. Oh yeah, there's also a new town, which has a whole bunch of farming garbage. So we'll just slide our ATV directly onto the selling point or purchasing. And then we got to buy stuff like a new trowel and then like carrot seeds. Why not carrot? That's 270 monies for a carrot. And then another carrot and another one and more carrots, and I don't even know how these work, but I'd like to buy this murder device. Hello, ma'am. <laughs> can I give it, can you just give me those carrot seeds, please? I'd also like to buy some tomatoes. Purchase, thank you. Wonderfully done, game. Now I'm hoping I can just slide right into the DMs, grab my runaway trowel, and start digging holes. Oh yeah, this is satisfying already. Also, it'd be nice if the game had tutorials, but no, we're not gonna do that. Oh, it's one seed per hole? That sucks. Oh, hot dang, I just found something important out. You can combine them and they stack. Oh, neat. If you can actually, there we go. Aha, uh aha. -huh. Uh -huh. Look at us, we got the big brain. Large thing happening. Except this one. This one's like, nah, I don't like those other tomatoes. They're weird. So now we sit here patiently for the next 12 hours waiting for them to grow. There is also rumors that we can find more seeds by digging holes in the dirt. So I'm coming back over to our nuclear mine to find uh, my shovel. Where is it? Are you down here, Mr. Shovel? Mr. Shovel, where, where are you? Oh, I didn't need to go down there. The shovel's literally right here. Is that a shovel? That's a rake. Maybe I don't have a shovel here. So I guess I'll go back to the store and buy a new one. Aw, I got stuck. I don't want a common. I want the advanced shovel. Where the world is... I don't... Whatever. I'm just gonna buy that. Oh boy, $600. Now will you just patiently lay down right on the back of my ATV? Just lay down. Not that way. Come on. Now just lay down. Beautiful. And now I'll just click buttons until I find a new seed somewhere. Three hours later. So I haven't found any seeds yet, but I made a stick man that looks like he has a large case of depression. Woo! Poor little stick man. Oh no, he's getting skinnier. Oh, little Ooh. stick man, don't do that. Actually, it looks like he kind of has a face on there too. Poor fella. And the worst part is there's a ton of vegetables here for me to buy, but I can't because I need whatever that thing is a token or something stupid. So after using my infinitely large brain, I have planted a bunch more seeds only to realize that these stupid things dry out. That means it's gonna take even longer than I expected because I don't have a watering system. And in order to buy a sprinkler, I need to have whatever tokens this place has. Yeah, 2,000 what? Oh, that's coins actually, sprinkler hook. Hooks out of pipes and sprinkles water. Mm, boy, I think I can do this. Because the old thing over here says the T things, but then this thing says the C things. So, might be a bug? Please don't be a bug. Oh, balls. Also, there's corn. It's got the lump with the knobs and the juice. Ah, that's what I need right here. A watering can. Buy it. Why can't I buy a watering can? Can I just steal it? <laughs> I'm gonna... 
<laughs> Go ahead, me. I'm gonna just use this for a while. Thank you. <laughs> Why can I steal a watering can? Just, uh, it's mine now. Thank you. I wonder if I can just drive into the ocean and fill it up. Oh, <laughs> invisible wall, go. Stay on there. Stay on there, little watering can. Oh, don't roll away forever. I miss you. All right, how does this work? You're kidding me. It's literally watering each individual. And there's four? Oh, you're <laughs> what is this game? I love how there's like a million fish hanging out here at the jeweler shop because like I built this weird machine last time that built up like automatic fishing, but I don't remember how to turn it on. So yeah, that happened. I wonder if I can sell this to the fellas and they'll be like, hey, I'll get trinkets. No, they give me money. I don't have any soup, dude. You want to fish? I can teach men to fish and I'll feed them for a lifetime. Open up. Oh, he didn't eat it. After a long and painful adventure, I finally have enough pipes to fill up my stupid watering can and now I can water my crops manually. Oh, it actually has multiple levels of water juice in it? Really? Why can't I drop it? You're kidding me right meow. Fine. Go in there. There you go. Uh-huh. Okay, just really... Why, why does this game have to be so difficult all the time? And now I just manually water all of these plants all by my fingers. And then I come back over here. Come on, fill it up. You just fill it. Can you fill it? If I hold it, does it get filled? Maybe. And then I'll test. And then I'm going to go insane. God, just drop the soup. Thank you. Got to be nice to it. Talk nice words. I need that sprinkler. I need it so bad. I'm going to go insane. Oh, yay. More water. Oh, yay. Sprinkle. 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 Wow. So much fun, developers. Woo. You've done. You've outdone yourself this time. Oh, these crops sure do love not getting parched. So real talk. <laughs> I... I'm either incompetent, which I know I am, or I'm incompetent, which I also know I am. But I cannot get this to work. The water does not want to go into the hole very well. Good. Very nice. It's kind of generically heated into my little hole I dug. Very nice. We get four waters, and then we come back over here and cry the water out. Oh, you're kidding me. These first ones are already dry again. <laughs> I'm going insane. And I can't water these because the leaves are no way. Oh. Oh, but there's red things. They're, oh, come on. Red things, I need you. Oh, you're kidding me. I watered that plant three times because this system's stupid. But I got red things. Oh, I murdered a red thing. Can I just grab them? Oh, I don't have to cut down the plant. That's slightly less fun. I like cutting down plants. I like cutting things. Well, I mean, at least I got tomatoes. My carrots haven't figured out what they're doing in their life yet. And I literally can't get anywhere in here. Okay, note to self, don't plant tomatoes on top of each other. And these don't look like tomato leaves at all. I wish I had somebody here to throw them at like intern. He would like them. He's like, yay, I like free food. But he didn't know I'm throwing at them really hard and it hurts. <laughs> also, why, where were the green tomatoes and the yellow, little yellow flowers? Those are kind of fun. Now, do I have to cut them down or do they regrow? Like these are science experiments we don't know the answers to. I also cannot physically grab, oh, there we go. Okay, note to you viewers, do not plant your tomato plants literally on top of each other. That's a bad idea. You know, it does make me wonder if I've managed to steal that watering can, can I just uh, borrow this long-term? I don't know why I didn't, stop, just get back. And just lay down right here, just sit, stay, no! Okay, and then just right down there. Why are you so incompetent? Maybe it doesn't want to be still. Yeah, I'm sure you do. I'm just going away. All right. Good to know that the uh, anti-theft system there has not been implemented yet. If I would have thought about that like a half hour ago, this would have been so much better. And then we, I think, just put that right on there, right? Oh, amazing. Look at how big brained I can be when I want to be big brained. And after a little more shoplifting, our middle crops are being watered properly. Good. All right. So I've also shoplifted a basket. Ooh, that's actually looking pretty nice. And I think that's a carrot. Ha ah, dang. Wait, how did they get two carrots out of a carrot hole? It's a little bit weird. There's three carrots in that carrot hole. I think the carrots forgot out a carrot. Also, that thing's growling like I ate Taco Bell last night. Buddy, you going to be all right? He's just got a case of the growlies in his gut. Patiently harvesting a field of carrots by hand.com. It's a new website, I just made it up. It's uh, just, you know, I don't even know what it is. Just click a button, drop a button. Click a button, drop a button. Click a button, 
drop a button. Hopefully I can get that new vehicle that allows me to harvest stuff faster. I also don't know if these things regrow or if it's just like, hey, congratulations, you made a plant and now it's done. All right, I got a basket of veggies. I feel like I'm, whatever, I was gonna say Peter Pan. Peter Cottontail, that's the one I think I'm about. And if I run these to town, somebody wants to buy them for unknown reasons. Maybe they're hungry. They like soup or something. Hello, yes, is there anyone here that wants to buy a big carton of vegetables? Would you like some vegetables, sir? I I'll buy a shiny new truck. No, he just wants a new truck. I'm sorry, I'm not buying you that. Bigger Would you cash. like vegetables? Oh boy, 400C. No, that's cash! I don't want money! I want it! Oh, really? The pen, whatever that meant. I got real money. I didn't want to sell my carrots for real money. I wanted the tokens. And I can't even put real money in the basket. That's stupid. Been walking around this countryside for like 20 minutes trying to figure out where the tractor I saw is. And I think it might be back in this town. If I heard a tractor, where would I be hiding? There it is. I guess that's a combine. Is it a combine? I don't know. Maybe it's a harvester. Oh, that takes 3,050 monies. Hmm, wait. I mean, if the other things, no, I can't. Hmm, how do I even get money? Would you like to give me the money? I would, but that's awkward, I guess. Well, the good news is that it seems like carrots respawn, maybe? No, I guess not. Probably they don't respawn. Hmm. So I've heard rumors that there's people around this city who are looking for vegetables, also flight patterns to Spain. And this lady right here is in dire need of four beautiful tomatoes, I think. Here, have some tomatoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, how do you, do you want them? Do you, you want? Oh, she just, whoa! Oh, yeah, it is, it's literally a tomato lady. Eat it, quit your whining. I gotta give it to you in a basket? Or man, I mean, this paper says an item soup will requirements is she gives, I don't even know how this works. Seriously, just eat your stupid tomato. Or right, you know, I'll give you the whole basket of tomatoes. You don't want those either. You're so entitled. So I guess I'll just go shoplift a nice empty, and actually, you know what? We have money here, I think. We do now to buy a soup bowl. Then I'll take that stupid soup bowl, I'll flop it on the floor, I'll dump all my dumb things onto the floor <laughs> next to it, Shove it inside the bowl. Would you get, would you please? You're just, you're embarrassing me right now. Get your stupid, ugly, round red self. Never mind. You know what? Pour a cooktop into the bowl to create some soup. I have to build a kitchen. I guess that's how it is. So I guess I get to buy the stove and probably the cooking pot and then a big stabby boy. And then whatever this thing is. Hopefully that doesn't need power, but it looks terrifying. And maybe a few more empty soup bowls. I don't really know how this works, but we're gonna figure it out together. All right, buy all that stuff. I also have a few items to build a house with. Gotta pick up my dirty tomatoes that fell on the floor. So if we have our ugly little garden over there, I should be able to grab this stuff and make the kitchen right next to it. I wanna put floor pieces down. Oh, nice. Nope, down, good boy. We gotta make it nice and sanitary in here, don't we? And we have a stove, sure. Don't know how it works, but I'm happy I have a new stove. It just literally started on fire. Okay, cool, and then we have a, a table that I bought for purposes. There's a cooking pot that goes on top of it, sort of. I mean, it's getting warm and junk. That's kind of cool. There's also the seed machine. I think we just put raw things into it and then we get uh -huh. seeds out. Also, it needs water. That's annoying. All right, so let's take one of these tomatoes. I don't know, do we put it in here? What does it do? We just have tomato inside the pot. You guys have already watched a bunch of videos of this and you're like, hey, Blitz, you're dumb. I'm like, huh? I know. So what happens if I use a Stabby Boy? Oh, neat. Okay, Stabby Boy. Does Stabby Boy go in a bowl? Nope. Not particularly. Stabby Boy go in the soup pot. Maybe I need water in the soup pot. Why aren't there any instructions how to make this work? Or you know, I have that famous scenario where YouTubers are just entirely blind and I need to cut the four tomatoes rather than just giving it to her. Also, she wants a soup bowl, but I mean, the raw tomato or the cut tomatoes don't want to go into the soup bowl, so I'm not really sure what's happening with that. Unless that's called the soup bowl. No, these are the soup bowls. Yeah, empty soup bowl. Pour a cooking pot into the bowl to create some soup. Is it literally just four Ooh. cut? Why? Gravity here, go home. Okay, if I put the tomatoes in the tomato thing, do I need to make soup? Let's see. Let's add some water juice to it. Here, have some water in your soup bowl. Uh-oh, it got wet. Is that, okay, we have tomato soup. Is this gonna work? Also, no, because you didn't, that, fine. And then we stand here, oh, ha dang, I made tomato soup. 
Now, does she want one tomato soup or does she want four tomato soups? I don't care. She's getting four. Wait, never mind. Because I think I made an entire... It's empty now. Okay. Hopefully that's what she wanted. Knock, knock. DoorDash. Got some uh, tomato soup. Nice bisque for you. Is this what you want? You spit it out. Oh, hot dang. She drank it. And I got tokens. T15. Neat. Now where are you going? I'm going to run over you. Did I say that all loud? <laughs> I mean, that was, a, that was a thought to myself. But, uh, I mean, when in Rome, right? Just uh, back this up a little bit. And then just wait for her to get on a path. Or slightly off a path. That's fine too, baby. <laughs> it's the most favorite thing in this game right now. It also turns out if we grab a map, we can see a couple little exclamation parts. Everyone with an exclamation part? Exclamation? I can't words right. That is a quest we can do. So I got to go over there and I grab these two already. And then I'll go over to Bastion Keep and get that one. Even though it's a little, really long run, I don't want to go over there. I just have to. And if I put it on my tailgate like that and zoom in, I can kind of figure out where I'm going. But it kind of blocks my visibility. But that's fine because I'm just going to drive over a mountain and fly to my destination. Or not. And wee. <laughs> okay, that was kind of exciting. Thankfully, Pinocchio here wants four tomatoes too. Dude, you need a nose job. That thing got... All sorts of messed up. Give me that. Out of my way, sir. Oh, the bridge got in my way instead. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, he's back for the round two. Nice. So we'll make up a little bit more soup. Graham here. Hot dang, want six carrots and a tomato in there. And everyone else just want cuts tomatoes. So we'll generically pick a carrot, throw it on the floor because it's easier than picking it up and putting it on the table. That looks nice. And then I'll indiscriminately take my cleaver and murder every single one of them because I have tendencies or something. We'll grab a red squishy boy and throw that on the ground and cleave that as well. And it's easier to work on the floor, like I said in the past, so let's just grab the carrots and just eat them into the thing. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Go home, tomato! You're drunk! Yeah, it was like six carrots and a tomato. I did it right. Why do you do this to me, you stupid thing? You're not supposed to bounce like that two three four five six there's a tomato in already only one of them click drop click drop that's not quite right click drop click drop click drop click drop okay that worked Stupid soup. You gotta put in the vegetables before you start cooking it. We're gonna take this stuff, we're gonna throw it over here, kinda give it to the dog. Even though I don't know why a dog would like carrot soup. And then uh, fill that up. So I've got a truckload of more soup to deliver to these pointless villagers. You know what? I think we should have made a restaurant where they come and get soup from me rather than me having to do this whole artisanal strawberry bisque sort of gourmet thing. I don't care about that, but I hope you enjoy spit because there's plenty of it in there. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, I'm glad you liked it. That was worth 11, $11, 11 fake dollars. You know, if we didn't accidentally shoplift all of those sprinklers, they cost 2000 each. After an hour and a half, I'm at 26, so that's stupid. And then we have this man here who's just squatting in my house. Yeah, Blitz's house, keep out. Do you not understand that, Could Dave, Carl, Bill, whatever your name is? Oh, you wanted the fancy soup that I messed up twice making. Hey, have that. Enjoy your spit as well. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Oh boy, coins. The jerk just threw the plate on the ground. He couldn't even brought it back to my house. So I guess I'm gonna go around town delivering nice hot Panera soup for the next few hours to get some tokens that don't really seem to matter too much. If you'd like to see more Hydroneer, let me know down below in the comments and tell me what I should do next. Also, keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. I'd also like to thank all of my channel members and patrons for help supporting the channel, including Auto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippius, Destructo Man, General Harris, Trent M, Joe B, Zarnoff, Maxer, Ral, VC Engineer, Whip It Good, Eagle Art, Deegan, Sir Caswar X, Spencer T, Whiskey, Doug Rules 2.0, Skunk Chess, The Corian, Rob the King, Brad, 8830 o'clock, Dalton C, Helfora, Sikander D, Grayson, Monkey, Kyle V, Zane W, Mr. Cripple One, Brad W, Soviet Cat, Stephen D, Dredge H, Caleb S.